Here you see the starting lineup. Naomi, Febri, Pennington, Richburg, Factor, Busby, Petty, Springfield, and Dominguez. It's Mary Beth Gorsuch making her first start of the season, the senior for LSU. And another nationally ranked matchup today. To believe in them when she's throwing them. She heated that one up and got Naomi on strikes. Player at East Carolina. 2 2 pitch. Swing and a miss. Gorsuch heated up the last three deliveries. She strikes out Pennington. Three up and three down, including a couple. Been a long time since they've seen it. That's hit hard the other way. It's cleanly through to left field, and Taylor Pleasance collects her fourth base hit of the year. I love that swing. Logan Simonek brings the off speed pitch that's looped to the left side. And Sydney Pennington makes a leaping grab. Pennington moving to her left, hauls it in, and LSU is done in the first. A base hit by Pleasance, but she's left at first base as Pennington covers some ground, stretches, and makes the catch. We go to the second. Oklahoma State, nothing. LSU, nothing. Richburg chased that one. It kept working its way outside, and Richburg... Name sounded so familiar Mike to Busby. me. Busby. Jams him with the curveball there. Oh. And Gorsuch does not squeeze the routine pop-up. Kind of nonchalant going after that ball. Swing and a miss. Gorsuch turned that one over. It was riding in to the left-handed batter. That's Deep to right shot. center, way back, way oh. back. It's on the glove of the right fielder and then falls to the ground. It's like all of these new gloves are a little stiff. The ball keeps popping out. Haley Busby tracked it down. It appeared she was going to make a reaching catch. And the ball trickled out of her glove. A double for Cummins with two outs. Ball seems to be traveling much better today to the right side of the field. Now watch Busby. She makes up a lot of ground right here. Reaches and had it for the moment. That's looped to the right side. It comes down in the glove of the first baseman, Allison Febri. Nobody out in the third. Lost her. And Springfield draws a base on balls. Sure will get a pinch runner. Pitch. Alexander. Not going. This is bunted. Picked up by the third baseman. And Doyle gets it over to Tidwell for the out. A liner to left field. That is trouble. It's down in the gap. A run will score as the ball is thrown back to second base by Savannah Stewart. So Kylie Naomi lines one to left. And Oklahoma State has scored for the first time this weekend against LSU. And why was that runner on second base? Good old-fashioned bunt. And a walk. True. Gorsuch didn't help herself out there. Well, Oklahoma State takes a 1-0 lead on the first base. Runner is on the move. Cummins cuts loose with a good throw. Safe on a close play at second. Naomi really got a terrific launch from first base. Cummins cut loose. With One and two on Febri. Out to right field it goes. Briggs is there. She's got it. Ooh, nice throw, Briggs. She figured in uh, ten assists and putouts in that game last night against LSU. That's a whole lot of action at third base. Amanda Doyle, the LSU third baseman, handles this in foul ground. Pennington throws to first base, and it's dropped by Febri over there. That is not the person you want to make. Andrews on the move, and the peg is not in time. Andrews actually butted that ball out of the glove. Of uh, Petty covering second. A 3-1 count on Taylor Pleasance with Georgia Clark next. And it will be Georgia Clark coming to the plate. That's that's two big mistakes. I think so. That's ball four. Simonek. 
as the water strike. The two one pitch. Oh. That hits Sunseri and we've got a tie game. Sunseri plucked by Semenek with the bases loaded. Third, Clark at second, Sunseri at first. Doyle loops it to the left side. It's caught by Pennington. She has been a busy young lady against LSU and turns in another. That's lofted out into center. It drops between Petty and the center fielder Factor. And now Pleasance is two for two. Ooh, close. That was close. Very close. Clark had a lot of faith in John Amelia. She has battled. Round ball, left side. Ooh. High Ooh. throw, and the tag made in time. Naomi to Febri for the out. Pennington is three for eight this weekend. And has a home run. And this one is hit very deep to left field. It is out of the reach of the leaping Savannah Stewart. A line drive home run for Sidney Pennington. You know, I knew it was hit well, but I didn't know it was going to go out of the park. Pennington. Lines it over the head of Stewart, who went back to the wall, leaped, but it was beyond her reach. And on that two-out stroke, Oklahoma State has taken a two-to-one lead. And Pennington has had a nice weekend, especially defensively. Good effort by Stewart, but runs out of territory. Next up for Oklahoma State, left fielder, number 13. Two to one. And that burns the outside edge, a call third strike. Six strikeouts for Gorsuch. It's in Oklahoma State, but the Cowgirls have a run more than the Tigers. And there indeed is that base on balls. That's two for Tidwell, correct? A blast into center field, that's down. It will roll to the wall. Taylor Tidwell rounding third. Here's the throw, Tidwell slides. Save at the plate. The freshman Briggs rips one into center field. A two base hit for Briggs and an RBI, and we are brand new in the sixth. That'll get you in the lineup. A great looking swing. She comes in here, another good looking freshman that Beth Torino was so high on, and she slams that ball in the gap. Give up four hits and three, uh, two runs. Will this stay playable? Febri is there, and she's got it next to the LSU dugout. Pleasance retreats and cannot make the catch. That ball looked like it hit off the heel of her glove. She was unable to squeeze it. She backpedaled a long way. And watch this. It's a new infield. You, she yeah. just overran it a little bit or over uh, backed up too much and had to reach. Oof. Left side. Stewart squeezes it. And Oklahoma State does not score in the seventh. Times. Hit deep. Way back it goes. ends the game for the LSU Tigers with an opposite field home run. Her first home run of her career wins the game against Oklahoma State. How about these freshmen for the Tigers? Briggs gets that uh, tying run with that base hit, and here comes what I am thinking is going to be the next superstar at LSU in Taylor Pleasance. A three-for-three three day punctuated by the home run over the left center field wall. And the freshman from Houston has won the game for the LSU Tigers, along with a wonderful performance in the circle by Mary Beth Gorsuch. Absolutely. This one, way, way back into the night, the leap from the center fielder factor, she had no chance. The teammates are waiting for Taylor Pleasance, and that, my friends, 
is a heck of a way to end the game for that freshman. Well, Factor gave it everything she had. She's trying to jump over that fence, but uh, wow, Taylor Pleasance is, is she's going to be fun to watch. So that wraps it up as LSU in dramatic fashion comes from behind a couple of times to win this game. Taylor Pleasance, the hero of the night with the bat, and the Tigers win for the fourth time in these opening days of the season. They will play again tomorrow at 1 o'clock Central Time against Florida A&L.